Hiya folks, it's Kikoskia here, and welcome back to Let's Replay Icewind Dale the Enhanced Edition. And when last we left off, we have cleared two of the minor crypts in the Vale of Shadows. This one here, and that one there. Aye. We also fell victim Aye. to a couple of traps, but they really weren't that significant. And the enemies also weren't that much of a threat, though there was a carrion crawler. Hopefully we won't encounter more of them. Oh, who are we kidding? There's a decent chance we'll encounter more of them at some point. Now, we want to bring our party over to the southeast of this map because this is the way to progress. It's also the way to a minor crypt in the corner that we want to check out before we go and tackle the major one. There are also going to be some enemies guarding it, but that is inevitable. What's also inevitable is us going to sell things because, oh boy, our inventory is laden with is Yeti pelts. We could farm these infinitely, but we're not going to. It'd be a very slow way to get money and a very slow way to get experience. Though it is, as I said, an infinite way of getting uh, these things. And experience is always welcome. Okay. I will do as you wish. Do we have a... Could be Yetis, you know. Ah! Right. This is, is the one all? that doesn't have any shadows guarding it. The one up there. There are shadows guarding it. Right, let's go in. You are not welcome here. Leave this place. Who are you? I am Theric. My brethren and I guard this crypt against intruders. Leave this place. Why am I not welcome here? You are not one of the faithful. Only a follower of the faith may enter here. Leave this place. I seek the evil that plagues Kaldahar. Would that be you? Kaldahar. That name is not familiar to me. I know nothing of Kaldahar. Seek elsewhere. Leave this place. If you are not responsible, then who is? I do not know. I tire of these questions. Leave this place. This undead is actually being pretty reasonable for an undead guardian. But we don't know if they're telling the truth. So we're going to say that we have no intention of leaving. I have no intention of leaving here. Then you shall die. Make peace with your god in what little time you have on this earth. Brethren, slay this intruder. So be it. Right, you are nasty. I need it. You get magic missiled. What? You also get lightning bolted. I'm here. And we're going to focus on these zombies. Yes. You have need of me. Stay back. Stay back. Okay, that's a lot of damage to Theric. And the lightning bolt's gonna bounce everywhere, this is fine. Stay away from Theric. Theric is a nasty undead, and probably has some really big spells, but I think we're okay now. I think we're okay. Only one zombie, and Theric, yep, Theric's down. Speak. Theric has a nice bit of loot. And that's a level up for Nerithana. Excellent. This is what we wanted. This ring here. It's a ring of the warrior. A ring is a small band of precious metal that is used as jewelry. Some rare rings have had enchantment, enchantments placed upon them that confer various magical abilities. These rings are highly sought after, especially by those of the adventuring type. For no apparent reason, this ring feels warm to the touch. Plus one Thacko. You know who can't use it? Magdus. Magdus is not allowed because Wizard Slayer. So we're going to give this to somebody else. You know who we're going to give it to? We're going to give it to you. 17 and 21 now. But you gaining a level up is really good. So let us save on a new slot and see if we get a good hit point roll. Roll level 10. Yep, I'll take 10. I'll take 10. Right. Um, Sling. Spear. Um, hmm. What else do we want to have here? Two-handed weapon style? Which would confer... Ugh, that's... None of these are really good. 
could give you Scimitar. But no, we'll go two-handed weapon style, so that if we do have to have you attack in melee, you get a plus one bonus to your damage rolls, and everything else there. We also got some spell slots. We got one more level one, a level two, no level three yet. So, I want... No alignment's not very useful. Give me bark skin, and give me... Give me Bless, honestly. What is it? I'm surprised we've gone this far without having Bless on our list of spells. Hmm? Could rest here. Shall rest here. 37 hit points for our druid. Very nice. Not a problem. Right. This is a slightly bigger I'm crypt. Here. Right. There could be traps here. In fact, I'm sort of Ready. anticipating Ready. there being traps here. How's your XP doing, by the way? Mm, still plenty to go. There was a question mark there. There it is. Nothing remarkable about it. Okay. Oh boy! Bunch of skeletons! We don't really need to worry about these skeletons. Come on, you two! You're pretty much the skeleton clearing out brigade. Massive amounts of armor class, ability to deal tons of damage quite quickly. Now, the uh, skeleton type that Derek was, what? later on, is going to be very prevalent. We're going to see a lot of them, and they're going to be a mainstay opponent. They sometimes drop decent loot. Hey, skeletons! We're just going to stay here. Very well. Stay on the bridge. Lovely choke point. Choke points are good for the enemy. They're also good for us. And there's another skeleton. Hello! I have come for stuff! Any loot here? No! Ready. No loot here at all. What? In Ford? Ah! Here comes five skeletons! We can deal with five skeletons, especially if we start shooting them. Because even with your ability to, uh, or rather the ability of the skeletons Speak. to resist our damage, we still deal a lot of damage chance. with that bow. A yes. lot of damage. I don't think we need uh, any more arrows fired here. No, we didn't call. That was a critical miss, by the way. More skeletons. What is your? How you doing? Also, the uh, music loves to restart as soon as it thinks about. Fa is that a? That's a high quality mace. What? That's not a bad thing to pick up. High quality mace is worth a bit more money than a normal quality mace. We'll keep that. Speak. Ready. We want to keep our eyes peeled for high quality variant like that. I should be paying more attention to these weapons, clearly. Cause uh Yes. We just got you some nice loot. These are high quality long swords. There we go. That's basically improved your uh Thacko by one. It's like we gained you a uh skill up. Anything else that's good here? High quality anything? High quality short swords would be really nice to find. I like that the game added high quality stuff. Just, you know, hmm? an intermediary point Aye. between getting magic gear. The Thacko increase at this early level Aye. is really, really useful. Give me a chance. Really useful. Right. Should be able to do. Oh! There we go! You have been paralyzed, or held rather. That would basically make you exceptionally Time easy to uh, you hit. Insist. Like, really easy to. Ooh. Okay, yeah. there's loot here, no but is there also a trap? There could be a trap. It will eventually no longer be held. There is not a trap. There's a helmet, a long sword. It's a nice looking helmet, though. It's a nice looking helmet. There you go. Hmm. Should I give this to Kor? Hmm, I quite like that on Kor, actually. And I could give you... Actually, do I prefer... I prefer it on you. Your inventory is full. If I pass you that and give you that. Look at me going with all the fashion choices here. Nobody else can wear a helmet. I'm here. Okay. Right the uh, paralysis has faded. And there is nothing down here. I don't remember if this dungeon moves into a new screen. I don't think it does. I don't 
don't think it does. It does descend... Ah! Darn it. It yes. does descend downwards, though. You better heal that. You better heal that. Also, you what is your better deal? heal up Magnus too. We don't want you to, uh, be in any bother. Okay, round the corner. I... Aha! That is a zombie. Every time I see the zombies, what? by the way, I think mummy. And then like, no, no, actually they're not tall enough for that. Mummies will arrive, though. We'll definitely face mummies at some point. And when we do, it will not be fun. Mummies, difficult. Okay. Take care of you. Take care of you. No high quality items here. Really want some high quality short swords. Speak. We'll probably get magic short swords eventually. Excellent. Down we go. Aha! Large horde of undead. Yes. You know what? Might be better for you to actually do this now. Really might be better for you to do this. Okay. I want you to start a... There you go. Offensive spin. You can start shooting this one. And we can just have at the... Is that a... Another high quality longsword? All right. What is it? Okay, zombie for- Ooh, ooh, that's not a zombie, that was a ghast! Yeesh! You can see now the effect yes. of turn undead. It has there. its perks. That is a lesser shadow. Very well. Get the lesser shadow. I'm here. Oh, that is some bad luck. We'll be alright though. I'm trying to make this fight quick. Oh, there's an arrow there. And another crit! That was two critical arrows in a row! Uh, there is some loot here. Absolutely want that. Right! I love that li random line that just appeared. You, you heard that from the uh, rogue. It's a good line. It's a good line. Now... Any... Yep, that's a ghoul. Right. Let's see any more enemies. Yes, there are. But we should be able to deal with this quite easily. Yes, we did. Okay, any more enemies? Yes, there are more shadows. Actually, there's a lot of enemies here. We shouldn't need to turn anymore. We actually use the magic missiles here. There we go. We actually have a level up for our fighter that I completely didn't notice. We'll deal with that in a moment. Just the fighter, though. That can sometimes get lost in the uh, din of combat. But we did it. Hooray! Victory is ours, and level up is ours, too. What do we have? Uh, 15 hit points. You know what? I'm going to go with 15. We get one Thacker reduction, a single point of lore increase. That really isn't important. Right. Like, lore increase, not a useful thing for a fighter. Stop turning undead. That's fine. We will save and begin the looting. On it. So I think we've pretty much explored everything here. The sarcophagus is sealed in some unknown manner. The lid will not budge. Right, that is a trapped one. Is it also locked? No. Is there a trap here? Ooh, high quality base. Mm. Any other high quality equipment? Yes! Another high quality mace. Give me lots of good high quality stuff here. Uh -huh. I gotcha. So there's no trap in this area. Okay. You have plenty of uh, carry capacity. Yes. What do we have here? Right. We have a scroll of invisibility. That's not a terrible treasure. That's a dagger plus one. A mainstay of all early D&D adventuring. And we can even have you identify that without needing the identify spell. I don't even think anybody can... I suppose we can have you carry it for now. You'll probably use daggers at some point. Right now, stick with the staff. Okay, last thing. Big treasure here. What do we have? Broken armor. Chill Touch, a potion of insulation. You can actually right-click here to uh, 
get descriptions by the way. This suit of armor, once a prized possession, is no longer fit for even a skeleton. It has been pierced in several places and crushed in others. The wearer could not have survived the blows that caused such damage. This is what we want though, the Sanctum Key. This is an ornate silver key with a red gemstone in the handle. Closer inspection reveals a small skull has been carved into the gem. We have explored this area completely. There is nothing more we can gain here. Let us go. Go and head all the way back to Kaldahar, because we have loot, and quite a lot of it too. And we're going to get some experience for returning the heirloom. We do want to get rid of all these yeti pelts. We definitely want to get rid of all these yeti pelts, and we can't have our druid transform back because... carry capacity. Our druid is not uh, going to be able to carry all the pelts. Right, so the only area we haven't explored is up here. This is the main crypt. The point of our uh, excursion here is to get to there. Though we do need the keys that we have accumulated in the other crypts to go and make much headway there. Not all the crypts are important. Two of them are entirely optional. But two of them, one of them conveniently very close to the main crypt of this uh, chapter, aren't because you need the keys. So back we go. After a successful excursion into the Vale of Shadows, by the way, don't fall, there's a big drop, very big drop, and it's probably really cold. Okay, back we go, to Kaldahar. Eight hours? What we now, I think the person we're looking, is that, is it you? No, townsperson, I think I need to go outside the potters. There, for Mirik. There we go. Actually, let's have <sighs> you do the talking. Idiot, indeed. Have you found the heirloom yet? Here it is. It was in the belly of one of the largest of the yetis. I don't think Silas made it. Poor Silas. At least I'll be able to pass this down to my sons now. But please take this. It's the least I can give you for your trouble. You're welcome. Farewell. We gained a sling. It's a sling plus one. And you know what? At this early level, that is fantastic. Because I'm pretty sure one of our party actually uses the sling. Yep, you use slings. I will carry no more. Wow, you are mad. Okay. Uh, that is a high quality longsword. You take that. So I can do this and that. Ah, you can't equip items while shape change. Okay, side. so unshape change, it? or revert rather. You're entirely over over encumbered, and now transform back. Only way we're going to get you anywhere is if you are currently a werewolf. Right, we want to go first to here and sell a lot of stuff. We have a lot of Yeti pelts to give over. So let's get to it. And lots of just random loot. Oh, lots of loot. You don't want the huge longbow. It's a shame. Um, the extra damage is nice, but the Thaco is too useful to have, and we don't want to lose armor class right now. At all. Yes, I see. Let's talk. Welcome back. I'm glad to see you're not dead yet. What can I do for you today? I'd like to purchase some weapons. Oh yeah, we have the short bow plus one, don't we? Um, do I keep that? Do I keep... Uh, by the way, 37 for the high quality longsword. Do I keep the uh, short bow plus one? Um... No. No one's really going to use it, so we'll sell that. Aspel's dagger? I mean, it's only worth five. Gonna sell that. It's not really worth keeping. Okay, Yeti pelts. Yeti pelts are absolutely worth selling. Absolutely all of them. 40 gold each. Suddenly we have 520 more gold. And there's even. Okay, now they're only worth 20. So slowly it becomes less and less worth it to, uh. to, uh, sell them. But they do eventually, I think, settle. Also, the broken armor is 200. I'll sell you some broken armor for 200. The huge longbow is 125. 
Which we don't really want. We're up to 2,000 now. High quality. There we go. Anything else to sell? No. No, we're actually done. Plate armor is 900. That's something to consider. Plate armor is 900. Don't know if I want to buy some plate armor yet. But we could. Also, short swords plus one are 1,200. But I think I right now we're okay. I don't want to do any of that. that one thing all? I do want to check is if Oswald wants these tools. They seem like something Oswald could make use of to fix up the boat. I'm j just, well, the airship. It's kind of a boat. I am here. Done. Hello. I couldn't help but notice that wooden box in your pack. May I take a closer look at it? Well, here you go. It appears to be a collection of gnomish tools. There may be something here I could use to repair my airship. Oh, yes, look at this. Where did you find this? It was in a yeti cave. Yes, I think this could be very useful to me. And, I suspect, probably just dead weight for adventurers. For the toolbox, I'm willing to part with some of my best potions. I think those may be more useful in your travels than some musty old toolbox. Um, that sounds fair. You've got yourself a deal, Oswald. Excellent! Excellent! Now, is there anything else I can help you with? Something from my stock, perhaps? We got... some good stuff there! We were given... Potion of heroism for free, a uh, potion of invisibility, and this can only be used by... It can't be used by quite a few people, actually. Could you use it? No. Well, this goes in our potion uh, bag, I suppose. Just put it here. Or potion, uh... It's a uh, potion... Yeah, it is a potion bag. Doesn't look like a bag. I it's not like a time. satchel. Which is a Where kind of bag. Go? Silly me being silly. Right. Well, we go back, all? folks. We have done some selling. We have uh, cleared our inventory of stuff, and uh, we're going to return to the Vale of Shadows, and once we return, enter the main crypt. We're going to be there a while. We might pop in and out a few times, but ultimately, we will find out what's going on and help out Kaldahar. It'll be so simple. We'll just go in there, do one dungeon, and oh, who are we kidding? This problem is a lot worse than just one dungeon. We know this. We all know this. Not a problem. And so, I'll catch you next time, folks. And I'll see you then. Later.